Hello. We are um, going to show you what we got in our Azure Standard order. My husband just picked it up. I am noticing right off the bat that my eggs are like demolished. So that is super a big bummer, but I will contact them and I'm sure they will make it right. Um, but we are going to get going so I can show you what we got. And uh, if you are watching this on YouTube, you can join me on Instagram, Her Hearts at Home. And that's where we do these live. So, all right, are you ready to get going? Yeah. All right. So, um, and I will share my link to Azure Standard in the description if you want to use it. We do get a $25 credit if you order $100 or more. Um, sorry, my dog is smelling the, smelling the eggs. So, I'll share my link if... If on the description if you're on Instagram you can go into my um, highlights and you can find my link there and let's get going okay so the first thing we got was a case of the um, Nancy's probiotic keeper this is the raspberry one six and of six of those yep and these are good until May 8th so we've got some time my daughter really likes those we also will put them in our smoothies and things like that Mom, that is so weird. Those ones came upside down, but these didn't. I probably just opened it upside down. And then we also got a six pack of the Strawberry Nancy's Keeper, the Probiotic Keeper. These ones are good until May 15th. So we've got about a month from the time we got it to when they expire. That's so weird. Is there only one in there? Yeah. That's funny. And okay. it came, this came on the side. <laughs> um, we got some of the Sierra Nevada Garlic and Herb Creamy Jack Cheese. This is just um, a little wedge. Of, this is not for you. My dog thinks everything's for him. So we really like these cheeses. We've actually shredded them up and put them on our pizza. They are good. Him. <laughs> you know, he thinks everything is for him. Okay, we can put this box out of the way. All right, what's next? Um... <laughs> one thing in it again. One thing and that one again. That's funny. Usually they pack things better than this. This is from Azure Standard. Um, and I did share a little bit about that probably before you joined. But if you um, are not familiar with it, what it is is like a um, Health Foods co-op on wheels. So you order online and then there's a drop local to you. You go pick up your items typically once a month. And it's really great non-GMO, mostly organic products. Um, there's like everything you could think of that you would need from a grocery store, Azure carries. Um, so I order every month from them and then um, my husband just picked it up today for me. So um, they have a lot of products that I can't find around here. They have bulk items, they have non-bulk items. Like I just got one of these, but you could order like an entire case of six of them. The price goes down the more you order as far as like per item, just like anything in bulk. Um, but this is, uh, Organic Nancy's um, probiotic sour cream. We really, really like. Um, you are in a small town. We are not in a very big town either. And I will say that I think most people have a drop within an hour drive of them. And I think an hour drive would be worth it. We only have to drive like 10, 12 minutes. But um, it's worth looking into. If you go to um, my highlights and you can find the link, you can click on there and you can actually see if there's a drop near you. I'm guessing there is. Um, they even have them in like Alaska, so they're all over the country. Uh, so, some sour cream. All right, what's next? Butter. Hummus. There's three butters in here. Three butters, okay. Yep. I got, um, I really, really like this. It is the Sierra Nevada brand organic vat cultured European style butter. I get the salted. I got three packages. They are eight ounces each. Um, this is Similar to Kerrygold, but I think it's better than Kerrygold. I will get the grass-fed Kerrygold butter from um, Costco as well, but I do like this one. It's organic. So I got three of those. Do you want me to open this or do you want it? Just... You can open it. Okay. Not... Here we go. Here. And then this is something that I got a case of. So this is a bulk thing. I got these little organic belly... Um, Chocolate milks just for my son's lunches or on the go. So I got 12 of these in a case. So I could drink them too. That came, yeah, you could drink them too. <laughs> I like them. So that came in like its original box, but they um, do actually uh, reuse boxes. So some of the boxes are very random that you get your thing in. So 
If you do order, don't be alarmed if you pick up a box and it has nothing to do with what you ordered. That's just what they do. I've seen um, them come in like Burger King boxes, so they reuse packaging just to save. And um, I like that. So this one actually came in its original. Is this pineapple? It is. <laughs> so this, it looks like cheese too. This came in its own um, box, so Azure box. And this is um, five pounds, right? Uh, yeah, five pounds of organic frozen pineapple. So we do a lot of smoothies. So I just got the big giant bag of that, oh and that God. will be used up pretty quickly, especially because I've got some hams in my fridge as well. And are you waiting for the dog? <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, so I will use this with my cooked pineapple too. Looks like bananas. No, those are um, potatoes. So this, yes, I was really excited about this because when I ordered it and it came came time for my order to ship, it said that this item wasn't going to ship and it was out of stock, but it came and I've been trying to order this for like four months now. It is just a five pound bag of organic diced potatoes. So you could use them for like hash browns or in soups or whatever you want to use them for. So I was really, really excited to get these since I've been trying to get them for a couple months. So that's also five pounds. You know what's that box was There's... Oh, this is the hash brown box. Oh. Okay. All right. She is. Well, knocked me over. <laughs> kind of chaos in here today. Um, I'm just waiting for my daughter. She washed her hands and she likes to be the helper. So I'll wait for her to come back. You can grab something out of there. Um, so they also send you a sales flyer every month when you order. So this will be what's on sale in May. And there's always really good articles. It talks about what new products are coming out. So I love getting these. I think you can opt to not get them if you don't want to have the paper copy. But I like to have the paper copy. All right, what's next? All right. This is 34 ounces of organic dried um, cannellini beans. And I was excited to get this. I've never tried it, although it's kind of, I don't know, it's kind of hard. So I'll have to see. <laughs> Maybe it just needs to be hard. broken broken up. I, I think I can break it up. But I know, I it is it. tomato powder, so it's organic tomato powder. So you can reconstitute this into tomato sauce, tomato paste, or tomato juice. So just a shelf-stable way of keeping a tomato product on hand. Um, if I don't have any like canned tomato paste, uh, yeah, I can break it up. I think it just kind of got hard in, ship in shipping, but the ingredients are literally organic tomato powder and it's good until January of next year. So this is one pound. I have never bought this before, so I'm not sure, but I see a lot of people getting it and they seem to like it. And then next is two pounds of almond meal flour. So... I thought I would try this. So this says that it's transitional, and what that means is that the farm or whatever it might be is actually using organic processes, but it's like a three-year process to become certified organic. So um, transitional means they're using those processes, but they can't sell it with an organic label, so you can get it cheaper. So if you ever see something that's transitional, buy it, because you're gonna get organic product at a cheaper price. It's just not certified organic yet. So. I got that. We are not gluten-free, but it's just nice to have some other things, especially because you come across recipes that call for other types of flowers, and it's nice to have them on hand. So I just got two pounds of that. Who got some more flour? Yes. Um, this is oat flour. Yeah, so this yeah. is organic oat flour. I was just trying to get the traditional organic one, not the gluten-free, um, but they sold out, so I switched to the gluten-free. This is a five-pound bag. Since we're not gluten-free, I didn't want to spend the extra to get it to make sure it wasn't cross-contaminated but this is what was in stock when it was time for my order to ship so I switched to this um, so they have traditional and gluten-free so if you're gluten-free they have very very strict policies like it's processed totally separate from any type of cross-contamination so good for you you know for those of you who have gluten intolerance know that you can feel good about buying them from him from them um, I would just go with the traditional one if that was available and then I got, I have never tried this pasta before, but I thought I'd give it a try. It's Bio Nature Durham Semolina Fusilli. I don't know. Just a different, like, twisty pasta. This is a 16 ounce package, and it's a product of Italy. And then, all 
oh, I got two boxes, no, three boxes of those. So it probably was cheaper to buy like a three count as opposed to just one. So I had to get three of those. And then this one is, I don't even know how to say that name. I'm not even gonna try. So same company, just a different shape. I thought these would make really fun, like gigantic macaroni. And then I got, just to try this, it's einkorn flour. Um, Traditional, 100% organic einkorn um, penne noodles. So I thought I would try these. Um, apparently einkorn is much easier to digest than other types of flour. So I thought I would give this a try. This is also a product of Italy. This is 12 ounces. So they have a lot of like um, gluten-free options too. And then I have bought these before and I just got another one. It's little alphabets. I know it's probably hard to see there, but this is fun for like little vegetable alphabet soup. Now Oops. the rest of the gluten sauces. Okay. You got three of them, I think. I got three of those, yes. So I've been that trying- That kind of damaged. No, it's fine. They're just gloves. They're I've been trying to order these for a little while and they keep being sold out and they were actually on sale this month. So I was really glad that they shipped and I got them. These are If You Care brand um, household gloves. So they are reusable and there's one pair in each box. So they're just like, as I thought for doing dishes and things like that. I get really, really dry hands. Um, so I grabbed three of those. Yeah, they're just like, Okay. Here's there's some other stuff. That's three of them. Three of them. Okay. Unless they're different things. Okay. And I got these last time, and I really like them. They are the If You Care brand as well, parchment baking sheets. So they're um, bleach free. Typically, I would get like the other ones at the store, but these ones I really like. Um, so I grabbed three packages of those because we do a lot of baking. All right. And then I got some um, homeopathic. Remedies from Highland brand. I got migraine relief, headache relief, oops, and ooh, pain just relief. pain relief. One of these said they weren't going to ship. Um, have I tried the Nancy's Cottage Cheese? Yes, actually, I got some um, last time and I used it in a lasagna. So we've really liked a lot of the Nancy's brand and I like that they have probi extra probiotic in it. So. Um, but one of these said that they weren't going to ship, and they all shipped. So sometimes they tell you things are going to be out of stock, and then you're surprised. So I just always leave them in my cart because I figure if they're there, I'll get them. So these were on sale this month. They're new to Azure. The brand Highlands is not new, um, and you can get them elsewhere, but they were on sale through Azure. So I grabbed all of those. Then I got, um, I have gotten this before, and we do like it. It's Sweet Creek Organic Enchilada Sauce. So we got that. <laughs> I don't know why they kept these in the cold. So everything is shipped cold to, um, it's in a freezer or um, you looked up and the closest one is one and a half hours. Well, I mean, you could give it a try if you order just quarterly. Otherwise, you can actually sign up to be a drop coordinator too. So that might be worth it if you, you know, like really want to use it. Might be worth looking into. Um, that's, I would probably do that if we didn't have a drop so close to us, but, um, yes, it says you can apply to host a pickup. You absolutely can. Um, and I know a lot of people will just use church parking lots or, um, I think even people have used an Aldi parking lot. So I think you would just need to get permission from wherever it is. Um, and then you'd have to obviously have a little bit of a flexible schedule because you would need to be there when the truck comes. But our drop is a coffee shop and they hold our products which is really nice most are not that way you have to be there when the truck comes um but that's like the norm people are just like prepared for that when they order from azure so um i got some of this lakewood organic pure lime concentrate um juice just to have on hand for like marinades and things like that and then oh so what i was saying is everything comes cold um or frozen so even if it's shelf stable stuff it will come cold and then you can just leave it sit out so anyways i was saying i got some of the enchilada sauce i've gotten that before and i got um three more of these jovial brand kidney beans they're organic they are a product of italy we have gone through the last three that we got and you can reuse the jars which i like um it's nice to have them on hand if you don't have time to make dry beans or you just need a small amount. These are good and they're better than buying them in a can. What's next? I'm stuck. You're stuck? Yeah. What do you mean? I'm stuck because I agreed to 
I had juice and in then my hand. I got this um, organic blueberry pomegranate juice. I thought the kids would like to try that. And then we got some blood orange juice. Yes. Yeah, so yeah. we've gotten this brand orange juice before, but the blood orange juice is new to Azure this um, month, and so we thought we would give that a try. It's definitely darker than traditional orange juice. I should take these. These are these. heavier. And then we got um, some organic blood oranges. This is five pounds? Yeah. A five pound bag. They're pretty small this time. We've gotten them before and they were larger. And then I did order them last month and they actually came smashed and rotten. So I actually got a credit. But these ones are still firm. They're just a little small, but that's okay for kids. Blood oranges? So, did you say? Yeah, so these are blood oranges, I think. Oh, they never close yeah, blood eyes. oranges. Yeah. I'm gonna feel them. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. And then I got these are, I'll open this so you can see them. They're the Norpro brand measuring spoons, a set of six, and they're long and they're thin, so they'll fit into spice bottles a little easier. Some of mine are too big, so I got that. I also ordered, I think some measure, a measuring cup, and that didn't come, so I just added it to my next order. And then I got this, um, so you can see that it's cold because it had been kept refrigerated. So this is Azure Market um, cold pressed avocado oil. So got that to try. That's fine. This is the Nancy's cream cheese, probiotic cream cheese. So I got this one to try. I only got one because we've never tried the cream cheese. And like this is good until the end of next month. So a lot of the stuff is good for at least a month if it's like dairy. There are a few things that they'll tell you when you order that there's a chance that will come very, very close to the expiration because it is shipping across the country. So, um, did I only get one of these? There may be another. I can oh, okay. I'll go to this one next. So this is, and I've gotten this before, this is the Rumiano Organic Monterey Jack Cheese. We really like this. I showed it up for tacos, nachos, things like that. There's the butters. Okay, two of them. And then this is just traditional butter, um, organic salted butter just for like baking. Lulabelle's is the brand. I got two of those. Did you already show this? And they are um, one pound packages for those. Yes. Did you already show that? Okay. Yep, I showed all that. Yep. What's next? And then I got a pineapple juice. We actually get this from Fresh Time as well, but it was cheaper to order it on Azure. So I got. A pineapple juice. My kids like to mix this along with orange juice. Oh my gosh! This was upside down in there. <laughs> Which one are you giving me next? Oh. Yeah, that was so this I one did. is organic sucanat. So it's whole cane sugar. I've never used this before, but I have seen a lot of people buying it and they really like it. Um, it's sucanat stands for sugar cane natural and is the most unrefined sugar you can find outside of a cane stock. So I thought I would give it a try. Um, it says it can replace brown or white sugar. Um, it has a molasses and sweet flavor. So it is a little like, they're almost like little pebbles they look like. So I thought I would give this a try. I see a lot of people using it. So give it a this try. This is so weird that that came upside down. <laughs> and then I got an organic chocolate extract. I thought this would just be fun to have on hand to throw into baked goods, give it a little bit of chocolate flavor. I've never heard of that. It's crazy. It's too, I can't even hold it. So this is 5.77 pounds of, my husband just gave me a look, of um, mild cheddar cheese. So this is the Rumiano organic brand. Um, I really like their cheese, so I thought let's just get it because like this, is a way better deal to just buy a big giant thing of cheese and then cut it up. Um, we go through a lot of cheese, so five pounds sounds like a lot, but probably not around here. So, um, and this, it just says packed on March 25th, 2022. So it's pretty fresh. I will probably freeze it. I'll shred it and freeze it and um, just pull it out of the freezer when we need it. Red. And then I got this Silver, Hi Silver Hills Organic Sprouted. Good. What was that? Um, <laughs> some oat, like oat bread. So 
It's frozen, so you can just pull it out as you need it. Oh, it was there's nothing glass in it. Oh, that's good. And then I got these organic sprouted power bagels, everything bagels to try. I tried a different brand of everything bagel last time, and I thought I would give these a try. So these all come frozen, so you can just throw them right into your freezer. It was just some. Um... No, is there three of them? And we got these a while ago, and we are getting to the end of them. They are Stacy's um, Organic Unbleached White Flour Tortillas. These are great for tacos. Um, my kids call them and cheese tacos. They just like to melt cheese in the middle of it and roll it up. My husband. That's just <laughs> That's like their go-to snack, so we just keep these in the freezer. I was just going to say, we also need this. I got three packages of them. Um, there's ten in each package. And they're just in the rest of it. Okay. And then I got some Thousand Hills brand. Um, this is actually in Minnesota, but it was cheaper to order from Azure. They are 100% um, grass-fed. They are never given any grains, uh, or no grain byproducts, no antibiotics, no grains, no added hormones. Um, and these are all from the U.S. and they're beef tenderloin tips. So I got two packages of those. They are frozen. And then I got a package, and I tried to order these last month, but they were out, and so they didn't ship, so I added them this time. Uncured Hickory Smoke Beef Hot Dogs, same company. So um, they are grass-fed. They don't have any extra nitrates or things like that added to them, so they're frozen. They'll just go right into my freezer. And this one here, right? Um, and then this is Organic Prairie um, Beef Summer Sausage. So I just thought I would get one of those to try. The reviews are pretty good. Um, and it comes frozen, so you can just thaw it out and use it when you're ready. But, all right, what's next, Early? You gotta be getting there, right? Yeah, this is, one of, this is the last box of prep those stuff okay. things. And then I got a five pound bag of organic yellow potatoes. You and, you want to put the pizza thing? What pizza thing? You said you got a big, yeah, that one right there. Yeah, yeah, no, that that orange thing. Um. Anyways, so U.S. number one organic yellow potatoes. Potatoes are one of the dirtiest um, vegetables that you can get, and so if you can get them organic, these are pretty small, but that's okay. Um, I paid like less for this bag than I paid for a like two pound bag at the grocery store of organic yellow potatoes. So, um, but what I did learn last time is I kept them on my counter, which is usually where I keep my potatoes and they went bad pretty quickly. So I will keep these in my fridge this time instead of out on the counter. These ones here. Okay. And then I got two of these. We got them last time. And we have until the 24th, so we've got over a week. So when you order this brand, um, this Alexander Family Farm, they do tell you that it's the they get it on a Tuesday, and it's only good for like 17 days from the time that they get it, meaning it still has to come across the country to you, depending on when your order ships out. So, yeah, so know that you may need to freeze these right away. These are good until April 24th. We got two, no, we got three last time. Two of them were just fine. The third one was sour before it expired. So I called Azure, they gave me a credit. It was no problem. They won't give you one if it is expired, um, but they will because it was like days before it was supposed to expire. But this is really, really good. It's vanilla, it's A2A2 milk. So it is easier to digest. So we will probably go through both of these before the 24th, but if I wasn't going to, I could throw them in the freezer. And these are made to be frozen. Like the company sends them with the intention of you freezing them. I know people buy entire cases. And they were on sale. I actually tried to order the chocolate milk in a case and I was gonna freeze it, but they sold out before my order shipped. Did you try this? No. And this one is also the 24th, and this is just a standard um, whole milk. It's vat pasteurized, meaning it is not as, processed is other milk so it is closer to raw milk um and there is a cream line it's hard to see because of the way it was in the box but there is a cream line on it so you want to shake it up good and then this is a nancy's larger thing of kefir the peach they only had in this big one so i thought i'd get this for my daughter to try so same thing as the little ones just a bigger one i think that one's bad is it mm, yeah i'll have to reach out to them 
Um, I the rest of them are. So I also got these two. Um, this is Baby Bella Mushroom Creamy Jack and Smokehouse. We've had these before. They're also the Sierra Nevada, so I've gotten a lot of their dairy products. So little things of cheese. Um, oh, it came open. Oh, okay. There's a... There's All right. Um, so I'll have to contact them. These are the grapefruits, but I'll tell you that some of them are not in good shape. So I will reach out to them, let them know how much for the milk. To be honest with you, I can't remember what it was. It is more expensive than I conventional love. milk. Um, if you go on there, you should be able to see it. I know I got them on sale. So um, I can't remember how much it is. Sorry. <laughs> I know it's not very helpful. But if you go on, you can see how much it is. Um, and then I, so this is, yeah, I'll have to just contact them. Um, so this is organic white basmati rice, but the package is open. So again, I'll have to reach out to them. Things like this do happen. But I think it just got ripped when yeah. it was being lifted. Okay, let's see. That's what it looks like. Um... I do not remember ordering this. This is goat cheese. <laughs> I don't think I remember ordering this, so I don't know. I'll have to check. If I did, I did. Um, there you go. Okay. And no, I already went through those oh, ones. Sorry. And then this is the Alexander um, Farm A2A2 Vanilla Extra Cream on Top Whole Milk Yogurt. Um, we get raw milk. It was four dollars a half gallon, but he had to increase. Yeah, I would say that that's probably uh, even more than, um, like the Alexander milk I think might be more than getting raw milk locally. So that's probably cheaper for you to go that way. Um, anyway, so some of their A2A2 yogurt. Um, and then this is Nancy's. We've had this before. It's 100% grass-fed probiotic uh, whole milk vanilla yogurt. And then this is an entire case of the um, orange juice. Six of us. Six things. So we'll store those. And then um, I really like this. Um, I'll open it so I can show you. I've gotten these in other orders, and I was just ordering three at a time, but I'm going through them pretty quickly, so I got an entire case. It's the Bio Nature tomato paste, no salt added. Um, they're seven ounce glass bottles. They're made in Italy um, And I really like them so we go through them pretty quickly So I just got an entire case and then I'll show you my egg situation This is super disappointing and I reached out to them and I don't know how this happened, but um, I Don't even know if I'll be able to just show you inside there, but there are eggs just like Spilt out. I don't think I can show you but there are eggs spilt out in the bottom, which is super um a big bummer um, especially because these weren't cheap so I'll show you here but I'm gonna have to reach out to them so you can see like they fell out of the carton uh, so I don't think I would order eggs from them again um, I thought I would give it a try but that did not work out well for me so you know things like that do happen I'll reach out to them I'm sure we're gonna need a washing machine to see if that's any eggs um, I don't even know if that's all my eggs um, anyways, I'll have to reach out to them for that, but that's everything that we got this time. I will, I already have a cart going for next month. We just add in our favorite things and I try some new things. Um, but again, if you want to try it, you can use our link and we get a $25 credit if you spend $100. Um, otherwise you don't have to use it. You can still just buy from them, but that's it, right? Mm -hmm. All right. Have a great day, guys. Bye.